What's up guys, if you're in the market for a Windows Phone 7 uh, device and uh, you think that the operating system looks cool but then once you get home and try it out you're like, uh, this isn't what I was expecting. Uh, is there a way you can do this without having to go uh, to the AT&T store or uh, your carrier store in order to try out the operating system on a certain device and next thing you know you buy it, bring it back home and you're not interested in it anymore? Well, Microsoft has uh, developed a solution that will allow you to try out their operating system before you actually buy a device uh, that is running Windows Phone 7. And please note, you can do this on iOS or Android. So, you can basically do this on any operating system. In this case, I'm going to be using iOS. Now, I would be using my iPhone, but this phone, it, it had a little bit of trouble when I was uh, trying to run the operating system. So, uh, I'm actually going to be using the iPod Touch 4th generation right here. And please note, this does not require jailbreaking. This is a non-jailbroken device, nor have I ever tried jailbreaking before. And what you're going to do is actually go into your Safari browser. Now, you guys do know I do use the Opera Mini browser on this iPhone right here. However, this demo is not supported on Opera Mini. So, what I actually have to do is use the Safari browser, which is why... Uh, my phone started crapping out. Now what you're going to do is just go on Google and type out Windows Phone 7 Demo. Okay, just click search. I, I would tell you the full link up here, but the, the link is too long, which there will be a link in the description below. And you access that link using your device itself. So Android, WebOS, BlackBerry, I, I think BlackBerry, I'm not sure about that. Um, iOS, doesn't matter. And you're going to click on this first link right here. Let me zoom in a little bit here. Where is this? AKA.ms slash WP demo. Windows Phone demo. And there you go. Windows Phone, welcome. Tap start demo and see how Windows Phone makes it easier to connect and share. Once inside the demo, tap any tile to begin and follow the blue dot. Okay, so we're going to start demo. And as you can see, we are now in Windows Phone 7 on our browser. Now, please note this demo, you are limited on some stuff, but it's basically a tutorial on how you can do stuff, navigate, etc. For example, let's go into this messaging app. Okay, they want us to swipe to the right. There you go. But while you are, while they give you the directions on what you can do, you can also do your own things. However, you won't be able to tap on stuff. That's one thing I don't like about this demo is that I can't tap on anything in order to see what it's like to be using that functionality. So we're gonna keep scrolling. Okay, and we're gonna click on that dot. We'll click on this arrow right here. Just click on the highlighted buttons here. And then we're going to click this button right here. And when you do that, it'll say, thank you, you have completed the messaging demo or so-and-so demo, return to start and try another one. So we're going to return to start. Okay. And of course, you can scroll to the right and then you can scroll down to your different applications here. Which, here's the thing, like these apps, I cannot tap on them in order to access them as well. So, the, this demo isn't really convenient. So, we can go into the phone. And it's basically the same process. So, we're going to tap on this button right here. Okay. And as you can see, I want to end call. But, yeah, this is basically a fake demo. Like, a fake call. Like, it's not actually calling someone. So, we're going to hit the Windows button. And click Return to Start. Okay, and of course we can go to people, and it launches, okay, what's new, blah, 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 and you can scroll down, scroll up, you can click on that add button, and you can click that thumbs up button, okay, you can click on all accounts, Facebook, okay, as you can see, now I want to view all these, but however, I can't. Which is kind of disappointing. And of course, tap. Oops. I'm going too fast here. <laughs> and then return to start. Now, I'm not going to go over every single thing about this feature. Because you could just try it out yourself. Now, 
Will this demo convince people to buy a Windows Phone 7 device? In my opinion, no, it will not. Because here's the thing. When you want to uh, try out something, you must be able to uh, test out its functionality and capabilities. For example, say you were uh, thinking about buying a video game, but you don't want to uh, spend 50 bucks on a game that you don't like. Well, what you can do, for example, Xbox 360, you can go into the Xbox Live Marketplace and to download a game demo of that particular game you're looking at to decide whether you like it or not. Now, that's what uh, I expect this demo to be. All it was is to tell you, okay, tap this, tap that, tap that, whereas you're not actually figuring out how to run this operating system. For example, these applications right here, I cannot tap on it. Uh, just, just let us try out a little bit of this of these applications here and then let's say if I tap on maps for example and, and they don't allow you to try that out uh, in the demo you can just say not available in demo you must buy a device w with a full Windows Phone 7 operating system in order to try this out and, and I'll be like okay uh, I'm gonna decide from there do I like Windows Phone 7 yes I'm gonna buy a Samsung Focus S or Flash or no I don't like Windows Phone 7 and uh, I'm just gonna look at something else and as you can see it's already starting to lag a little bit So overall you could try this out if you want I will leave a link in the description below, but I just want to know like How is this gonna? Convince people to buy a Windows Phone 7 device if you don't even have any functionality in this demo that you can do Like I can't go into alarms calendar camera games Internet Explorer blah 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 I can't even tap in that uh, mag magnifier button, whatever that is. So, if you want to try out the operating system itself to see what it's actually like to use a Windows Phone 7 device, I recommend you go into the store or you borrow from a friend and you don't want to get out of your house or something because this demo right here, to me, it was developed poorly and it doesn't actually convince someone to buy a Windows Phone 7 device. It actually doesn't convince me at all, even though I already know what it's like to use that operating system. I actually played around with someone's phone that had Windows Phone 7 on it before, but looking at this experience right here, this will not convince people to get a Windows Phone 7 device in my opinion. So if you guys like this video, make sure you click that like button down below as well as subscribe for more videos like this. Now, what are your thoughts about this demo? Did this convince you, you know, to buy a Windows Phone 7 device? Tell me why, why not? Uh, I'd like to see what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And for more updates, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash Ben and I am signing out right now.